Hello. Hello. Can you hear me now? Oh, still connecting. Okay. I guess that's fine. <clears throat> I'll just wait. <clears throat> Hello. Yeah. Hi. How are you today? Um, I'm fine. Okay, I'm fine. fine. Why not? That's a good answer, actually. Very good. So, uh, did you go to school today? Um, yes. Uh huh. I see. Okay. You can't just say yes in my class. You must answer with a full sentence. So my question was, did you go to school today? And maybe you can say, yes, I went to school today. Yes, I went to school today. That's good. Okay, that's how you do. You just uh, answer every time just like that. Okay, so what time did you wake up today? Um, I was waking at uh -huh. 7 o'clock. Okay, I see. See here, uh, I'm going to show you how the the homeworks will be created here. <clears throat> and let me just try this one. Okay, here's how we do. I'm going to make one thing, answer the question. And then I'll say answer. And this is the question. What time did you wake up today? Okay. What time did you wake up today? What time did you wake up today? Okay, so I'm going to write it down here. What time did you wake up today? And then, uh, what is your answer for that? I was wake up at uh -huh. 7 o'clock. Uh, that actually is I woke up at 7 o'clock. Uh, I woke up at 7 o'clock. I woke up at 7 o'clock. Okay, so this will be the answer. We'll try. This is going to be your homework now. So look at this. Your homework will look like this. So you go to default here. No, not really. Okay, I'll I'll just change this one a little. Okay. Go to your homework and then you'll see some sentences like this, but cards. And what 60. time did you wake up today? No, 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 no. Okay. This will do. <clears throat> what time did you wake up today? This is how we do. You just hear the question. And then you make this answer. That's how you practice now. So I'm going to do it again. What time did you wake up today? I woke up at 7 o'clock. Uh-huh. I see. There should be one more thing for you. That is wake, walk, and walken. Wake, walk, walken. What wake, is walken? Wake, walk, walken. Good question. Okay. Wake is what, the, what is wake? Um, wake. Uh huh. Right. Wake in Korean. What would that be? Um, wake is um sleep. No sleep. No sleeping. Uh huh. I see. No wake is actually you sleep first and then you open your eyes. That's wake. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. That's in Korean. That would be like this. Then walk is the past tense of wake. So this is wake. I walk, and then wake is intransitive verb, which means this doesn't have the past participle form. So I'll say. It has no meaning so far. No, not yet. Okay, so wake, walk, walken. Um, okay. Okay. Then that's another type of what question. What time did you wake up today? Okay, let's do it again. So how to say it? I walk, walk, 
up at seven o'clock. Perfect. I woke up at seven o'clock. That's how you do. You do your homework and then you just、uh, listen, answer, listen, answer. That's how you do. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. What time did you wake up today? Oh, oh no 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 no. I'm sorry. So just now I made one more here, and then this will go to today. Just here, it will be here. Wake, walk, walken. Oh wait 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 wait. I need to change the wake size walk, of it. Walken. So the size should be sixty points here.、Yeah. Wake, walk, walken. So what is it in Korean then? The wake is 일어나다. Good. And walk is 일어났다. Uh huh. And walken is wake. 과거 분사. Very good. So do you know 과거 분사? Do you know what it is? No. Okay, then I'll explain here as well. So in this case, maybe I'll say you don't know 과거 분사. So I'll say, oh, right. <coughs> I'll explain. So, what is 과거 분사? It's past participle. That's how they call past participle. Past participle, or in Korea they call it PP. That's past participle P and P, and in Korean that is 과거 분사. But even if we know the name 과거 분사, what do we know? Nothing. So we need to know what this is actually about. So 과거 분사 is this is 과거 분사 past participle. That's the first example. I mean, not the explanation. And second is where do we use it?、Um. Mm. And there is another one too. Those are three things you want to remember. Um.、Mm、hmm. All right. I will ex explain this too. I like questions. I love questions. Yeah. Okay. I explain everything you want to know. Okay. Um. What is um 형용사? Ah, I see. I see. I see. Okay. 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 Yeah. I'll explain. So this will be basic card, and then you ask me 형용사. Yeah. Very good. That is called adjective. 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 That is adjective, and now I need to explain. Okay.、Yeah. First thing is, but even if I say 형용사는 명사를 꾸며준다,、oh. what does that even mean? You don't understand. So you need to know the the the, the what is it? The sample. I mean,、uh, some like unit examples. What does that mean? 형용사는 명사를 꾸며준다 means. <clears throat> okay. Ah, right. Yeah, that's what it means. Yes. Then okay. Now you must have the、um, the question. 명사. Do you know what this one? 명사. Um. No answer. Okay. Not exactly. Good. I'll teach you. So 명사 this time is is called noun, noun, no. noun. That's 명사. But the problem is, even if you know 명사, this just like, yeah, maybe let's talk about our friend 명훈. 명훈이라는 친구가 있어요. 네, 예. 근데 우리는 명훈이라는 친구의 이름을 아는데 그 친구 얼굴을 몰라요. 그러면은 수많은 사람들 중에 명훈이가 누군지 모르겠죠. 
그러면 네. 안 된다는 거예요. 그래서 우리는 명사라는 친구의 이름을 알아야 되는 게첫 번째고 얘가 도대체 뭘 하는 애인지를 알아야 됩니다. So, 네. 명사 is. 음, 대스 명사. So, for example, I can say, um, okay. Okay, so can you give me anything? Something that has name? I can give you... I can give you... Uh, okay, pen. It's a pen. Yeah. And I can yeah. call it. It has name. So pen is a noun. Pen. Yeah. Okay, so can you give me something? Pen and what else? Um, oh, yeah. It's because it's a name. That's why it's a noun. But let's not do it because it's confusing. Look around your room. Can you look around your room? Maybe you can just uh, say anything. What do you have in your room now? Um, um. I see a door. Door is a noun because it has name. Yeah, door. And, and what? What? What do you have in your room now? Um, sunglasses. Okay, so glasses. Now, yes, it has name. But by the way, uh, do you, uh, did you just uh, turn off the camera or did it turn off yourself? Um, I is all. Now all is. Yeah, I, I don't I don't see you. I don't see you at all. So that's why I'm asking you. Okay. So the video, okay. Pen, door, glasses, and what is what has nouns? Um, what is noun? Anything. Just one more. Just one more. 명사. Okay. Yeah, that's noun too, but something else, something that I can I can touch. Something tangible, something can touch, you can touch. What do you have? Eraser. Eraser, yeah, of course. It has name, so it's a noun. Very good. So that is how you learn things. Okay, then, all right, I guess you know it now. So let me show you how it works. Okay, so you said eraser. Yeah. What is eraser? Um, eraser, eraser. That's right. That is, chuge, eraser. Then now I want to ask, what about expensive? Expensive, expensive. Expensive is, ah uh, no, way. expensive is like yeah right. You need to pay a lot of money. That's expensive. Yeah. Okay, then now I will show you how it works. So look at this. Expensive eraser. Okay, expensive eraser. I want to see some kind of picture here. Oh, okay. Maybe that's an expensive eraser. Um, okay. Okay, so... Uh, what? Is that a re in re eraser? Are you serious? Oh, okay, look at that. I think this is an expensive eraser. Look at that. So oh. it, it has a case too. I like it. Okay, I'm going to use this picture. And then I'll explain this to you. So. I'll use this here. Come on. Yeah, this does anyways. Okay, this is expensive eraser. Oh, okay. Okay. So when we do, you need to understand. Eraser is a noun. Yeah. Eraser is a noun. And then expensive is...
Okay. Um, yeah, right. Um, okay. Uh -huh. So I can probably show you this just like this. Okay, and then the arrow should go like this. Adjective. Yeah, this is adjective. Because oh. it explains things, yes. And the eraser is a noun. No. And of course, I need to tell you this is... Uh, yeah. So it's going to be a perfect picture for you. You'll understand. Hey, how much should that be? I, I think that's not expensive, is it? Not sure. But uh, okay, let's do it. Okay. And then the next card is this one. <clears throat> I'll make your homework like this. Yeah. You need to know this. You need to know this. And you need to know this. And you need to know this. And you need to know this. You need to know this. You need to know this. And this too. That's how it works. Okay. Let's try it. Okay. What time did you wait? No, no. We need to go to default. And then move it all to today. An option random good what time did you wake up today i woke up at seven o'clock okay very good i woke up at seven o'clock and what is this um object <laughs> no not really this is Adjective. Uh, ad, ad, adjective. Yeah. Adjective. 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 So I just put some sound here. Then adjective. wake, walk, walken. What is that? <coughs> Very good. You're smart. Okay, you're smart adjective. actually. What is adjective? Okay, is. And oh no 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 no! It's Tongsa. Let's go. Let's go. So, uh, okay, okay. Of course, of course. Then now we need to expand it to the next one, expensive eraser, and then we will move it to the next one. Is uh, I bought an expensive eraser. Yes. What is I bought an expensive eraser. What does that mean? Um, 나는 mm -hmm. 비싼 지게를 샀다. Right. Then now we have one thing here. Boat. What does that do? That does. Um. Aha. Uh -huh. And that is called verb. And that is called 동사. Uh huh. So, well, this is practically the same. I'll just put it here, and then you'll see. I bought an expensive eraser, and of course the error goes here. Okay, that's verb. And you need to know, verb changes three times. Like how? Buy. Boat and boat. Do you know the meaning? Yeah. What is buy? Buy is 사다. Okay, but this is transitive verb, so it has yeah. object right away, which means yeah. it's gonna be 무엇을 사다. And boat is 무엇을 샀다. And the last yeah. boat is 사진 구매된. Uh huh. That's how it works. Okay, 그럼 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, yes, yes. And this can be adjective too. <laughs> Look at that. Mm -hmm. So, um, okay, it's exciting. I love it. I love your questions. Very good. Okay, wait. I'll just make it cleaner, make it better. And then this is three changes. Okay, that goes right here. And again, yeah, and the second one is here. And what else can I do? Oh yeah, of course. Okay, that's how it works. And boat, that goes all the way to Hyeongsa part. Hyeongsa. Um, Why is that? It's because what is eraser? Eraser is juge. Okay. But what about then boat eraser? No. I said it's adjective. Oh, boat. No. That's why I said it's adjective too. Okay. This is the big picture. That's how English work. All right, then I'll make it all again. Delete them all. Time is not a lot of time. What is important is that the image is the image. What is important is that the image is the image. What is important is that the image is the image. What is important is that 이해 못한 상태에서 외워봤자 다 잊어먹어요 어차피 Okay, now one by one You need to know this Of course you need to know this adjective And then you need to know this is adjective Okay, and when you see other things you need to know this Expensive eraser Of course this too And this one too You need to know in Korean English Meaning and also Korean and verb. Okay, that's true. This too, and of course Korean name. And you need to know the sentence. And when you see Korean sentence, you need to know English and vice versa. And this one is called like this. And of course, you need to know three things here and the three changes too. Practically everything. Let's go. So, what is this? <clears throat> um, wake, walk, wake is probably. Oh, this is walken. The last one. Wake, walk, walken. Ah, yeah. Hey, fine, fine, fine. Adjective. What is it? Okay. And you need to understand what they do what this does you need to understand sometimes you read it and you can get it don't worry okay then noun what is it very good so such as like this oh, oh, oh you know what i must do it too then yes this so we will talk about the, the examples of it what can you say? I can say expensive. That's an adjective. And what else? Um, what is upper street? Example? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. Example is, uh, okay, I'll, I'll write it down and explain. But before that, 
Yeah, that is this is example. Oh. Oh, expensive is one example, and now we we need three more. Okay. Can you give oh. me three more examples of adjective? Yes. Um. Um. What is opposite for ex expensive? Opposite, uh, opposite meaning? Yes. Oh, the opposite meaning of expensive is cheap. Yeah, yes, cheap. Okay, what is cheap in Korean? Um, sada. Yeah, oh no, no, san. A uh, san. Uh huh, okay, what else? Two more. Um, happy? Happy, yes, that's a, 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 an adjective. Very good, happy. And what else? Just one more. Um, sad. Uh, again? Sad. Sad, happy, sad, expensive, cheap. Yeah, all the opposite words. Okay, good. That's how you do. Very good. Okay, so now you know, and I'll guess. Uh, what about this? Um, Wake, walk, walkin. Mm, right. Wake, walk, walkin. Mm -hmm. Past participle. What is past participle? Um. Um. 과거 분사. Okay. That's right. That is past participle. And remember, there are three ways to use it. Okay. And next is expensive. What is expensive? Bisan. Okay, good. Eraser. Mm -hmm. Hey, what is this part now? Um, That's here. Um. Um, no. uh, uh, ah, some yeah. something that has names. There's a uh, there's a uh, noun. Okay. And next, what about this? You need to talk about. Oh, uh, what? Oh, yeah. This one. Three changes. Um. By. Both. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna record it by boat boat by boat boat good by boat boat and next what about this um, um verb yeah right. Okay, you understand. Verb. 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 And this, how would you say it in English? Bald razor. Yes, perfect. Bald eraser. Bald eraser. Bald eraser. And this? Um, yeah, that's noun. Good. And this in Korean. Uh, something like that, but you need to understand. What yeah. is Hada? It's because this is transitive verb. Do you understand transitive verb? Um, no. Okay, fine, I'll teach you. So I'll teach you transitive and intransitive verb. Transitive verb and transitive verb is 타동사 um. and intransitive verb is 자동사. Okay, those are two different uh, like just general verbs, and uh, the difference between those two is huge. One. 
is uh, ah. That's one. And second one is That's the second one. And third one is uh -huh, uh, That's the third one. And intransitive verb is one. Do you understand or do you not? Um, you don't understand now. Don't worry. I understand, so I'll teach you. So maybe I'll make some examples. This one is 수동태. 수동태 is passive voice. And the example sentence is Can I say? Okay. Uh, the car. Oh yeah. The game is played. The game was played by me. What is it in Korean? The game was played by me. Um, gamer. Uh huh. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> that is passive voice. Okay. And what else? There's something called active voice. Active voice is the opposite way. Um. So in that case, we can say. I played the game. What is it? What is I played the game? Okay. So they are opposite. So yeah, one thing you can use as passive voice here. And this can be just like this. Both eraser. Then what about okay make this sentence can you say it who play the game in english oh, okay the game was played the game was played no that's passive boys i'm saying this to play the game. Then, okay, let's start with this. Simpler. To game. What is it? The game. Okay. And now, the next question is, what about... What is this in English? Play. Played. Right. Uh, yes. Then Play. now, my next question is, what about to play the game? The played game? Yeah. Just like the boat eraser, same thing. Okay, so that's what I'm saying. You can use it. All right. Uh, maybe I just need this. Okay, fine. Oops. So this goes here, I think. So we need to talk about two things here. 타동사 and this. And then now I have a question. Do you listen to music sometimes? Um, yes. Yeah, okay. Then I can make a sentence. Can you make this sentence? I... Listen the music? Ah, uh, uh, no, 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 no. 
Listen to songs. Um, listen to songs. Then we have a question. Look at that. Play. You need to understand play. Play. Played. Played. What is play? Um. 하다. Okay, something like that. Yeah. What? Because it is transitive verb. And. And the last one is this. But what about listen? What is listen? Listen. And listen. What is it? Oh, what was it? Uh, okay. Yeah, right. It's not. No, no. This. And what about listened? 들었다. Okay. And the last one listened is. It has no meaning. It's not adjective at all. Okay, so this is the difference between those two. All right. So, okay, I'm going to close the room and then I'm going to reopen it and invite you. So I'll see you in a bit. I'll invite you again. Okay. 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 So this is transitive verb and intransitive verb. Of course, it's complicated, but remember, this is worth it. 영어에서 어려운 영어가 어려운 이유의 80% 정도의 지분을 차지하는 애가 얘예요. 얘네들. 그렇기 때문에 이걸 이해하면은 굉장히 많은 거를 초반에 이미 이해하고 넘어가는 겁니다. All right, so what do I do? This part and this part and this part and this and this one, and of course, this. Yep, this and this, and this and this too. And this, and this, and all of it, and of course all of it. 이거를 많이 배우는 게 중요한 게 아니라 뭘 하나를 배워도 제대로 이해를 하는 게 중요합니다. 그걸 위해서 지금 이걸 하고 있는 거예요. 이거 솔직한 얘기로 고등학교 학생들 몇 퍼센트나 이해할까 이거를 별로 이해 못해요. 이거 이만큼 요거 중요하고 수동태로 사용 가능. 오케이. 수동태도 중요하고 뭐뭐를 바로 받을 수 있어. 목적어를 그 다음에 얘도 알아야 되고 얘도 알아야 되고. 목적어가 키포인트 이걸 못 받는 거예요 수동태로 못 바꾸지 그 다음에 과거 분사를 형용사를 사용할 수 없음 형용사 과거 분사 이것도 해석 가능해야 되고 전치사와 프리포지션 관계 30개. Okay, 갑시다. Adjective. What is adjective? Um, adjective. Uh, 형용사. 
오케이. Okay. And uh, 이거 이것도 알아야 돼요. 이게 뭔지를 나중에 알아야 됩니다. Well then, what about this? 음, 과거 분사를 음. 이동태 알바디라. No, 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 no. The third one, the arrow goes to the left side here. It's not the passive voice. Okay, fine. Do it again. Yeah, right. Good. Expensive. Very good. Expensive. Eraser. Mm -hmm. Eraser. And this one, what is it called? What's the name? Um. Um. I don't know, I'm sorry. It's okay, don't say sorry. Don't say sorry, it's fine. It's passive voice. Passive voice. Uh-huh. I'll just record this one here. Passive voice. Passive voice. Passive voice. Okay. Um, 능동태. Yeah. Um... No, 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 no. PP. What is PP in Korean? Um, it is past participle, and in Korean, it is that. Oh. Okay, the third change. Good. 형용사. 지금 머릿속에 지식들이 내가 말해줄게. 무슨 일이 일어나는지 말을 해줄 건데, 봐봐요. 머릿속에 지식들이 하나하나가 찍혀 있단 말이에요. 그동안 배운 게 있을 거라고요. 학교가 어디든 어디가 됐든 이런 식으로. 근데 문제는 어디서 주소 들은 이것들이 걔네가 어디다 쓸 데도 없고 얘네가 뭔지도 모르는 거예요. 근데 선생님이 지금 뭐 하고 있냐면은 얘네들을 다 이어주고 있는 거예요. 얘네가 다딴게 아니라는 거를. 각자 다 의미가 있고 이런 식으로 다 연결돼 있다는 거예요. 연결 안된게단한 개도 없어요. 이런 식으로 다 이어줄 거예요. 하나하나. 이렇게 안 하면 못 외워요. 어, 이런 식으로 만들어주고 있는 겁니다. 네. Okay. 이걸 알아놔야지 다음 질문이 생겨요. 그래서 그게 뭔데? 이런 식으로. 오케이. Okay. Good. And this? 음, 수동태. Yeah. You can't make 수동태 with that. Okay. And this? 과거 분사. Yeah. That's right. And okay, not really. I'm going to increase this option to probably 1000. Okay, we have more to go. I listen to songs. What is it in Korean? Uh uh, no. Look at that. I. Good. Um. It's okay. You just do it more and more, and you know. Intransitive verb. Intransitive verb. Intransitive verb. Good. Intransitive. Okay, that was intransitive verb, and then what about this? Um. Creep. Ah, uh, is. Active. The active voice. Right, active voice. Active voice. Active voice. So all, active voice. All the normal sentences are active voice. Okay. Um, okay. And next is yeah. What is it? Three changes. 하다, 을 사다, 을 yes. 사다, 을 uh huh. Good. Very good. Now you understand. Okay. Passive voice? What is passive voice? Ha, ha, oh, no, 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 no. Sudongte. But it's okay. Just do it every day. Okay, so what is it? Um... What is it really? I don't know. Um... 과거 분사? Is it? Oh, no, no, no. Three changes. Okay. 
and this um i don't know okay that is a uh, intransitive verb intransitive verb intransitive verb uh-huh but it's okay you'll see more and you know transitive verb what is it okay good very good mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in that case look at this i listen to songs songs this is object but you can't just have object right after the verb listen that's why you have preposition too Mm, yep. Preposition. Mm. Um. Oh no. John Chisa. Do you know John Chisa or preposition? Do you know them? No. No, okay, it's fine, it's fine. I'll teach you. You have everything here. So, okay, I'll explain. Preposition. Preposition. That is 전치사 in Korean. And you need to know what this is about. One. Okay, that's first. So, example, do you have anything like this? Maybe I can say on. On is preposition. Yeah. And what else? In? Yes, good. And what else? Under. Under. Perfect. And one more. Behind. Behind. Yeah, across from, behind, under, above everything so it's a lot and next is uh, and what about this hmm. when what was that when aha yeah. uh -huh. that makes sense but it's not preposition something else um what time at? is it yeah at right at Add is okay, and what else? I think add mm. is fine. And oh, oh man, eh, eh, we already did it. And what else is there? Add in, maybe on. And what else can I say? During, no, on. I think that's it. Fine, three. Look at and what about look for look around? They are all different. Look at what is look at? Okay, and what about look for? <laughs> <laughs> Good. And next, look around. Uh-huh, right? Okay, so three cases. When do you use it? First, place. Second, time. Three, object. And uh, intransitive verb plus preposition to have object. Okay, that is preposition. A lot of information. 지금 엄청나게 배우는 거예요, 솔직히. 근데 이거를 주고 그냥 툭 던져주고 외워 이게 아니라 프로그램 자체가 안키 써봤어요 지금까지? 아니요. 아 안키를 쓰면 알게 될 텐데 프로그램 자체가 
이거를 진짜 사람 잡을 정도로 계속 보여주는 게 아니라 조금 내가 잘 기억하는 것들은 천천히 보여주고 이런 식이에요. 그렇기 때문에 숙제를 양이 계속 늘어나는 게 아니라 양이 유지가 돼요. 그러면서 계속 머릿속에 남아있게 만들고 오케이. 안키 깔았다고 했죠, 전에. 네. 오케이. 자, 화면 공유를 받아서 선생님이 한번 세팅을 좀 해줄게요, 지금. 화면 공유를 한번 해줄 수 있을까요? 그 화면 공유를 어떻게 해야 되지? 그걸 어떻게 해야 되지? 컨트롤 탭에 보면은 선생님 같은 경우에는 이렇게 나오는데 내가 이거를 알려줘야겠다. 아이고, 또 없어졌네. 잠시만요. 예. 자, 여기 보입니까? 화면? 이게 선생님 화면이에요, 지금. 여기 보면은 여기에 뉴랑 쉐어리라고 된데 있죠, 이거. 여기. 네. 거기 누른 다음에 화면 공유하는 거 있거든요, 저기에. 본인도 아마 있을 텐데, 이게. 네. 이거 공유 누르면은 여기서 어떻게 해야 되지? 공유를 누르면 선생님한테 이제 본인이 보는 화면이 선생님한테도 그대로 나와요. 내가 지금 보여주고 있듯이. 어, 잠시만요. 이거 마이크로소프트 원드라이브. 마이크로소프트랑 관계가 없을 텐데, 뭐지? 이 뭐가 있던데 잠시만요. 네. 이거 마이크로소프트 쉘 보이던가? 아니 그게 아니라 이 줌이라는 프로그램 자체에 화면 공유 기능이 있어요. 이, 이 근데 이거 공유를 누르는데 일단 여기 마이크로소프트 원드라이브랑 마이크로소프트 쉘 포인트랑 구글 드라이브랑 박스랑 이런 게 뜨는데 화면 쉘가 잠깐만 그럼 내가 다시 어 됐다. 어 됐어요. 전 지금 화면 쉐어, 쉐어가 되고 있는데 어 뭐지? 어 되는데? 어 지금 뭘로 하는 거예요? 수업? 노트북이에요? 아니면 뭐 다른 거예요? 패드입니다. 아 패드로 하는 거예요? 네. 그럼 여기 패드에는 안게 안 깔려 있죠 지금? 네. 아 그러면 안 되겠다. 알겠습니다. 그럼 다음에 선생님이 알려줄게요. 어떻게 하는지. 따로 안내를 해줘야겠네. 지금 컴퓨터에다 바로 세팅을 잡아주려고 했는데 잘안 되겠네요 그러면 은 오케이 okay, 알겠습니다 그러면은 어 컴퓨터라는 게 아니었군요 알았습니다 오케이 okay. 선생님이 암키 받은 컴퓨터에다가 파일을 보내주면은 거기에서 암키를 풀면은 어떻게 되는지 보여줄게요 자 여기서부터 설명을 해줄 건데 아 카메라가 자기 맘대로 계속 꺼지는구나 네? 카메라가 또 꺼져 있길래 세팅이 그냥 자기가 알아서 끄는 걸로 돼 있나 봐요 아마도 자 볼게요 선생님 지금 여기서부터 숙제 안내를 조금 해줄 건데 앙키에 들어가서 네. 앙키에 그럼 아무것도 없을 거잖아요 지금 가진 게 그죠? 그러면 어떤 상태가 되냐면 앙키를 처음에 켜면은 이런 상태로 나와요 앙키에서 처음에 아무것도 없어요 여기 네. 근데 선생님이 이제 파일 하나 보내줄게요 지금 카톡을 통해서 파일 하나 보내줄 건데 선생님이 방금 만들었던 모든 카드들을 여기에다가 이거거든요 휴대인데 이걸 갖다가 전부 다 선생님이 보내줄 거니까 이렇게 했고 이 카드를 선생님이 카톡으로 보내줄 거예요 자 보자 가야 되더라 여기 여기에다가 어... 이렇게 만들고 여기에다 또 만들어서 apkg 파일을 보내줍니다 이렇게 해서 여기에다가 세이브를 하는데 from kenny to ssh라고 하고 05월에 11일 됐어요. 여기 있네. 지금 카톡으로 보내놨거든요, 파일을. 네. 그러니까 이거를 제가 만약에 이제 학생 입장에서 똑같이 하면 어떻게 되는지를 보여줘야겠죠. 디폴트라고 이렇게 돼 있어요. 여기 안에서 네. 그 카톡으로 받은 파일을 풀잖아요. 세이브 한 다음에 그 다음 오픈을 누르면은 이렇게 돼요. 
갑자기 바뀌었죠. 네, 네, 지금 그 상태에서 보면은, 어, 네. 네. 아니 지금 안 봐도 돼요. 어차피 봐봤자 소용이 없어요. 컴퓨터가 아니기 때문에. 그러면 여기서 뭘 하냐면 은 컴퓨터에서 여기 from the class라고 된데 들어가서 study now를 누르고 what 오늘, time did you wake up today? 오늘 할게더 이상 없다고 나올 때까지 쭉 하면 돼요. 그냥 그렇게 매일 반복하면 돼요. 네. 자 이거 아까 하는 법 저희 같이 해봤죠. 그죠? 네. 이게 어떤 카드가 나올 때까지 반복하면 되냐면 은 이런 카드가 나올 때까지 여기 보면은 축하합니다. You have finished this deck for now. 이 덱을 모두 끝냈군요. 이런 문구가 나와요. 한글로 나오겠지만 이게 나올 때까지 숙제를 하면 돼요. 음. 매일매일 그렇게 반복하면 됩니다. 근데 그렇게 많지 않을 거예요. 오늘도 그렇고 한몇분안 걸릴 겁니다. 아마. 오늘 배운 걸다 하는 게 아니에요. 오늘 배운 것 중에 20개만 하는 거예요. 매일매일 20개 새로운 카드를 이렇게. 오케이. 자 오늘 수업하면서 질문 있거나 뭐또 물어보고 싶거나 모르는 것들. 얘기해 봅시다. 그걸 설명을 하고 넘어갑시다. 그러면 이거요. 휴대폰 이거 받은 거 있잖아요. 뭐 받았죠? 그거 선생님이 방금 보내주신 파일이. 아, 휴대폰에 받을 필요는 없고 그 컴퓨터에 카톡 깔려 있죠 보니 까 아니요. 안 깔려 있습니까? 그 엄마 거 깔려 있나요 컴퓨터에? 카톡 자체가 안 깔려 있는데. 아 그래요? 그러면은 어 컴퓨터에서 이 파일을 열려면 가장 쉬운 방법이 뭘까요? 이메일? 네, 이메일인 것 같아요. 이메일 좀 부... 아, 복잡한데? 그래요. 이메일로 합시다, 그러면. 이메일 할 건데 그러면 이메일 주소를 주세요. 그걸 보내줄게요, 지금. 네, 지금 음, 네. 아니, 그냥 카톡으로 보내면 본인이 그거를 갖다 이메일로 이렇게 보내서 하면 되는 거 아니에요? 어, 잠시만요. 카톡에서 받은 파일을 그렇게 하면 돼. 아니 그냥 이메일 보내줄게요 그러면 어, 저번에 아 이거 이메일로 보내주세요 아, 아 카톡에서는 못 보내 되긴 네, 될 텐데 카톡... 이메일 주소를 주세요 그러면은 네그네아 그... 주스... 네. 카톡으로 왔습니까? 오케이 카톡으로 봅시다 아 이거구나 이렇게 해서 그러면은 이걸 보내놓을 테니까 05에 몇 시지? 11에 APKG 라고 해서 보내놓겠습니다 이거를 닫았나 보네 네 보내놨거든요 이거를 네뭐좀 있으면 가겠죠 이걸 이렇게 해서 다한 다음에 그 다음에 이걸 저한테 또 보내야 돼요. 숙제를 다 끝낸 다음에 결과표를 보낼 건데 네. 여기에 보면은 맨 끝에 보면 톱니바퀴 모양이 있잖아요. 네. 여기 이거 누른 다음에 익스포트라고 있어요. 세 번째 거. 네. 그 누른 다음에 여기에서 건들 어 요거 하나 둘세개 있어요. 체크하는 거. 이거 세개다 체크해 주고 그 다음에 익스포트라고 누르면 파일 세이브 하는 거 있어요 여기에서 네그 파일 세이브 한 다음에 그 다음에 그 파일을 선생님한테 다시 보내주면 돼요 아... 어 그러면 숙제가 어떻게 되고 있는지를 선생님이 볼수 있어요 네 이거 지금 다 기억할 필요 없이 선생님이 수업 영상 다 보내주잖아요 수업 끝나면 그죠? 네네 네, 그거 보고 하면 됩니다 네 선생님 근데 저 이거 일단 이거 왔거든요 아네 근데 이제 이거를 이제 이거를 여기 컴퓨터로 보내야 되는 건데 이게 이걸 어떻게 보내는 지 컴퓨터로 보낼 필요가 없죠. 컴퓨터에서 이메일을 열면 되잖아요. 아. 어. 그지. 네. 똑같죠. 예. 핸드폰으로 열 필요는 없죠. 오케이. 그렇게 해서 숙제를 어떻게 하면 되겠다라는 얘기까지 됐고 숙제를 그럼 언제부터 시작을 할까요? 오늘 시간이 좀 있습니까? 오늘 은 오늘은 조금 그래요? 그럼 내일부터 시작할까요? 네 그래요 내일부터 네. 시작합시다 내일부터 시작하고 그러면 오늘 동사표는 제출할 거죠 그죠? 네 오케이 동사표 오늘 제출하는 걸로 하고 내일부터 숙제 시작하고 그리고 다른 부분들 오늘 뭐 수업에서 배우는 것 중에 좀 모르겠다 대신에 뭐 이랬으면 좋겠다 저랬으면 좋겠다 이런 것들 아무거나 있습니까? 없는 거 
그래요. 없는 것 같으면 지금 당장 말안 해도 되고 어, 카톡에다가 언제든지 물어보고 싶은 거 있으면 물어보세요. 네, 알겠습니다. 수고했어요. 받아들이는 게참 빠릅니다. 잘 배우네요. 오케이, 좋습니다. 금방 배울 것 같은데 질문도 좋고 오케이, 오늘 여기까지 합시다. 수고했습니다. 그래요.